I'm the marketing events team lead at Renewal by Anderson. We go to all kinds of fun events across the state. We have a fantastic team and we always meet great people at the events and get to introduce lots of new people to our products. When I'm not at work, I'm usually spending time with horses on the farm. Up in my shoulders of where I told you I volunteer as the executive director of the North Carolina Therapeutic Riding Center. We have been around for 46 years. We work with children and adults with really any disability that we can safely accommodate. We offer equine facilitated psychotherapy, hippotherapy, and adaptive riding. Oh, and we have an inclusive summer camp as well. I would say every single one of them has a very unique personality. Bo, she is not coming to scratch you, you ridiculous child. Um, here, I will just open this and we can duck under. They know when it's time to go in the arena and work and do a job and they're very professional, but they also still bring their personalities. This is Mr. Bojangles. If he feels like you're late feeding him and his pan is out here, he will grab his pan and throw it in the air to get attention. He'll throw it over the gate if he thinks you're really not fast enough with bringing him food. He's a total goofball. We actually work really hard at making sure that the horses have the best quality of life possible so that they can kind of reserve all of their emotional bandwidth for bonding with our clients. This is Indara. She is definitely one of the most popular horses in our program. So she's what's called a draft horse. So you can see she's a little bit thicker boned. It also means she's got a little bit slower twitch muscles. So she is very calm and slow and allows a lot of our clients to ride that it would be tough to find another suitable horse for. On average, we screen out 49 horses for every one that makes it into the program. We want horses that have been exposed to a lot of different situations so that we can reasonably expect how they're going to react in a unique situation. You know, if a child has a meltdown or if a child has a seizure. We have found horses from some of the most unique places. You never know when you're going to run across the perfect one. We have gotten horses through friends of friends. We have horses that are um, on loan here because they're retired from another job. They might be a little bit older and need kind of a step down career. They're not quite ready to totally retire, but they don't need to be jumping and competing anymore. We have a great bunch of horses out here. When I start feeling a little bit burned out, literally all I need to do is go and see a kid on a horse grinning and doing something that, you know, their parents and they never thought they'd have the ability to do. It makes everything worth it. We have clients who are not able to speak, but they can get on and ride a horse. We have clients who use a wheelchair, but they're able to ride independently. It's pretty amazing to see horses and clients work together and, and just do things that nobody would have thought was possible. A long time ago when I first started teaching, I had a client who was this absolutely darling four-year-old boy and he really only wanted to use words that started with a B. So he rode a pony named Morgan for the entire session. Every single ride before I helped him get on the horse, we would go through, what's your pony's name? And he would say blue and the pony's name was Morgan. So, but every, every single ride without fail, he called that pony blue felt like the whole session we weren't making any progress you know we repeated that same conversation every week I tried to get him to say Morgan he said blue he came up to me at this ice cream party and kind of tugged on my overalls and said can we give Morgan a carrot and I almost fell over if his teacher had not been there and overheard I would have thought I was just hallucinating you just never know what connections are kind of clicking and what progress might be happening even when we can't really see it.